hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel i'm lisa hazel and please subscribe if you haven't already and if you have subscribed and you've been watching my video thank you for coming back so today i've decided to peel bananas as we talk about something of course these bananas were brought were brought by my aunt from from a country she had grown up country and she decided to bring us bananas from my grandmother's home from my aunt's home actually she had gone to my grandmother's home but then she decided to go and visit my actually i'm, I'm taking them from the other side they may slide so she had gone she had gone to visit my grandmother and she thought it was to maybe go and visit my aunt and my aunt gave her bananas you know in in africa not in africa let me say in because i've not traveled there in africa so i don't know in kenya in luya land when someone goes to visit a, another person they usually go with maybe a gift and they come back with a gift i don't know you can tell me what your culture is because of our culture when you go to visit some someone you come back with banana. So I'm taking this pile of paper. I want to use it. So, what do I have here? I've been watching Miss Trudy in in what? In up country. She went up country and she visited her grand grandfather and she was with Malika. And by the way, Malika said that Malika said that her home is in Shetala. And I was like, oh my god, you know what? That's my home. <laughs> so, Malika, that is my home too. Actually, my my maternal home. So, and I think Miss Trudy is just one of a kind. She thinks of where she's come from. You know, some people when they just make it in life and they don't want to see the people who made them, who made them be who they are today. And it's just I don't know. Uh, I watched Miss Trudy. Don't mind if I keep looking down because I'm actually feeling. I told you I'm feeling bananas. I'm using these papers because I don't want the. You know, when you feel bananas, that what do I have to say? That nini. Actually, I'll show you the knife after I'm done. I'm missing a, an old knife because I don't want to spoil the new knife. It's something I don't know which color comes from the from the nini, from the bananas and they just color your fingers and hand and, and knife of course. So I was saying I've been looking at Miss watching Miss Trudy's videos at home when she visited her grandfather when she was just at home when she went to pick malika actually that one was the funniest thing imagine she went and she was just trapped in a lesson <laughs> at uh, upon okay this girl kumbe hana maringo as in miss trudy is just one of a kind she adapts to everything and yeah i expected her to actually she ate she ate using the utensils at home. You know, some people go up country and then they're like, I won't eat here, I'll go to buy food. They just eat out. They just eat out of the house, maybe in a hotel. But Miss Trudy is appreciating their efforts, man. You know, when you go home and you don't want to eat the food that you are provided with, those people tend to think that you are maybe, what do I say, Kona Maringo, maybe they just, mm, they try to, what do I say? They feel like they are not appreciated. That is the word. They feel like they maybe you think you think they are dirty or what? I don't know. But Miss Trudy is just breaking the record. Yeah, she is even dressing in an African way. Any very soft girl. Day. Yeah. And like when she is in maybe in Nairobi, she just dresses like an Nairobian, and that's fine. That's cool. So. I've been watching their videos, the videos, the Miss Trudy videos, and I'm just happy, happy for her, because, oh, when she was, when she was taking us, when she was eating African food is, is when I, I thought, my, is when I thought of these bananas, actually, my aunt brought us many of them, and we've been eating and eating and 
these ones remained. So today is the final day, I think. Today is the final day. What do you think of Miss Trudy? I mean, she's just a good girl, yeah. She's visiting people in her country, gifting them. She has even promised her grandfather. She has even promised her grandfather that she'll, she'll have a flight with him. And it will all depend on the suggestions in the comment section. In her comment section, that is it. So, let's go and comment where you want Miss Judy and the grandfather to fly to. Because the grandfather said he has once flown. And speaking of you know, African food, Miss Judy actually talked about fruit, fruit blender how they blended the watermelon and pineapple and I thought of something she said they didn't add water or sugar it was just natural blended watermelon so and I thought of these watermelons that we these blended juices that we need that we take maybe in town that we buy in town actually the water and they're just very bad and I tested the one of the new blended juices in Multimedia University I think that's one of the original natural ones despite the fact that we don't know where the new the trees have been planted where, whether they are using chemicals or what but that one was what do I, that one was natural I'd say yeah it was natural Mm -hmm. So, another thing that I saw in that video is the ugali, the African ugali, the brown ugali made nini. It was the ugali, do I say the ugali was made of millet and sorghum? They just, kusiaga kwa English ni, they ground, yeah, they ground millet and sorghum and made ugali, the brown ugali and actually I feel I miss, I miss that brown ugali because it has been a while actually I don't know how many years right now because it has been a while I usually go to a country but I just take ground maize flour and that is it so what do you think, where do you think Miss Trudy should take her grand, her grandfather Go to her YouTube channel and watch that video and subscribe and comment where she should take her grandfather to. And why do you think? Actually, her grandfather talked about African marriages and he said that he can't advise us because we are unadvisable we are unteachable why do you think we are unteachable why why do why are we just unteachable why can't we be taught and understand what the elders are saying i don't know any anyway, guys thank you very much for watching till the end it has been your girl is a hazard and don't forget to like this video if you like it of course if you like miss trudy oh and by the way i almost forgot so if you are in diaspora or if your relative is in diaspora and he or she is finding it hard to send money back home you know christmas christmas is approaching and people are expecting their relatives who are well off or maybe who travel abroad to send them money to use maybe for christmas parties and stuff so if your relative is in abroad and you you want or they want to send you money and they're finding it difficult to send the money please use sendwave tell them to download sendwave sendwave it's on play store tell them to, to download sendwave and use the code m miss trudy m i double s t r u d y miss trudy by using that code, they'll be given a $5 discount. $5 means 500 shillings. 500 Kenyan shillings. Yeah, and that is it. You just get the money and you bash, you bash, you bash, you bash. Thank you for watching, guys. Thank you.
thank you for those who have subscribed if you, are, if you haven't already subscribed don't forget to do so goodbye